Hey, hello, welcome guys. So in this video, we are going to learn about stage operations. So what is a stage file activity in Oracle integration? We will learn about that. What kind of operation we can perform in the stage file activity? In this video, we will know about that kind of operations. I will create separate videos where I will do each and every operation and will create separate integration for that where I will elaborate you each and every point that what we operation we can perform and why we will use that kind of operations everything in this video we will just explain you about the, the operation what is the operation we will show you the definition of that operation and all so let's begin so here we have a stage file activity in our Oracle integration. So whenever we are creating integration, we need we need any activity that can be helpful to work on the file operation that will help you. The, so we have a stage file operation. With the help of a stage file operation, we can create a file. We can read the data of the file. We can create a zip file. Even we can uh, archive a file or like we can make a, a unzip of the file and various activity we can perform with the help of stage file operations. So whenever we are working on the stage file operation, it means that we are working on the file that can be available over Oracle integration virtual cloud virtual directory only we cannot perform operation on the file which is available on the server with the help of a stage operation so if we want to work on the file which is available over the server first we need to read the file or we need to download the file uh, from sftp server to oracle integration cloud or we can say oic then we can use a stage file operation to read the file read the data of that particular file or like whatever operation we want to perform so remember a stage file operation is only going to help you to work on the file which is available over oic virtual directory only so when we are saying that oic virtual directory it means that when we are creating a integration it means that for that particular integration instance they provided the space so if we created a, uh, with the help of a stage file if we created a file we created a csv file or txt file or any xml file that file will be available only to the oic cloud for that particular instance only we cannot perform directly uh, operation on the file available over the server so there are the few, uh, few details related to the stage file operation so here if you the first point is the stage file is an activity to work on the file remember a stage file is an activity it is not any adapter and all so we can we cannot use this stage file as a event as a trigger point right or the invoke point for invoking any any connection and all so as this is a stage operation is not adapter so a stage file cannot be added as a trigger or invoke as i mentioned the stage file activity used to create file like csv file xml file or any text file or anything with the help of a stage file operation we can create a zip file that can be merged merge the different different files or located over a single directory a stage file creates file in oic virtual directory only right so uh, let's let's see what kind of operation we can perform with the help of a stage file operation in in our oracle integration so we can perform eight type of different different operations in oracle integration with the help of a stage file operations so here if you will see we have listed all the operations which we can use with the help of a stage file so the first operation what we can do is that we can read the entire file we can read a file in segment we can use write operation to create a file in oracle integration we can use a zip file operation to merge or create a zip of multiple files okay that can be the zip of single file the zip file operation can be useful while creating integration to upload zip file over ucm server so before going to upload zip file we need to create the zip file so that zip file stays operation will help you here here we have unzip file operation that can be helpful to unzip the file the zip file we can use encrypt file operation we can use decrypt file operation and the last we have list file operation so this list file operation is only going to list give you the list of files available for a specific directory with the file pattern only so let me first explain me about this different kinds of operation that is read file read file in segment and write file so here if you will see the in read file uh, segment where we can say that read entire file we we have to provide the structure of the file what kind of file we are going to read it's mandatory to provide the structure before be, without providing the file structure we cannot read the data of that particular file 
So what kind of a structure they allow? They allow a structure as a CSV file or XSD file or we can say XML file. Opaque schema is not allowed here. In the read fi entire file operation, we cannot use opaque schema. And while using this read entire file, we can remove the trailer while reading the file. So trailer, it means that suppose we want to remove the first line that can be the header of the file. We can use that one. And the one and most important part is that we can read max file up to 10 MB only. If our file size have more than 10 MB, we cannot use the read entire file operation. For that, we have different operation that is read file in segment. So let's move to the different operation. The next operation is read file in segment. Read file in segment will help you to read multi read a file in a segment in a batch of 200 records. So why, why, when we will use read file in segment? So whenever we require to read a file that can be the up to that can be the size more than 10 MB or the maximum size can be the 1 GB. So we can use read in side read in segment operation. So this stage file operation that is read in file read file in segment will help you whenever we we are going to call BI report and the data we are receiving from the BI report that sometimes the data can be up to maximum uh, like more than 10 MB. So in the time we cannot directly use a stage file read file or read entire file operation. At the time we need to use read file in segment operation so that we can read the file of the data in a chunk of 200 records. Here also we cannot provide the opaque schema. We can use remove trailer operation while reading file in segment so that it can remove the first line of that file. We can we have option to process the file in sequentially. If we will not uh, provide the option to process file sequentially, it will process the file parallelly. That is the default features for that read file in segments. And remember the most and important part is that in read file in a segment also we can read file up to 1 GB only. We cannot read the file which have the more the size more than 1 GB. Remember the max size max file size we can read is 1 GB. And the next operation is that write file operations. Remember we are using write file operation to create file or write file in OIC Oracle integration. So suppose we have data, we have some request payload or response payload coming from any API or we want to receive, we want to place that data in file and we want to provide this, uh, the file data over the email and all. So we need to create one file that can be CSV or XML file. So for that we require the write operation. Write file operation will help you to create file in, in OIC. Here we, we can use append operation that will be helpful to that will be helpful to merge multiple files. So suppose we created the first time we used the right operation created file with the 10 lines and we want to uh, we have another file and we want to merge both file together. We can use right operation and we can provide the append multiple files together option to merge the file together. So this is all about a stage operation in next videos. I will create videos that, that in that videos. I will use create integration and will use all the operations in that integration only. Thank you so much for watching.